Good morning. Are there any deers down there? <laughs> I saw two turkeys over there, but they're gone. There were six deers, but they walked and came this way. That's why I came to see them, but they're gone. There were six of them. I got two nearby and they had a four or four, but they walked away. Yes. They walked away. Then I saw two turkeys up there and they were they were very entertaining. They were like a chain from me, half chain, backward and forward. But the deers all went away. Yeah. <laughs> and you could hardly see them because they look they're camouflaged, you know. So I thought they might be down here. Yes. I, I yeah, they're gone. Uh, I was having a side the first so one. Ah, they are so beautiful. Yeah, they are. They're so beautiful. They are God's creation. Yeah. You know? And I lived my life so long, and it's about two years now I started seeing the turkeys and the deers. I used to live in Toronto, so yeah. I moved here now, and I, one or two times we came and I saw them here, and some of them up there too. So it's just exciting for me because I've only seen them on pictures <laughs> until just now, you know? It's very exciting. Now that I'm retired, I have a chance to see them. I used to drive in these years. I used to live in limousine and minivan. Yeah. So I drive people in these years. I said, one day, Lord, I want to bring my family into these areas. And I actually live in here, you know. So I'm just catching up on what I didn't get into before. Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful. Wonderful indeed. That's, all, that's what my father would say. Although I, almost, I saw a deer a little too close the other day. That was right about sunset. Yes. I jumped up in front of my car. And then I stopped because I knew. Another one jumped up behind it. And if I just kept going, I would have hit the second one. Wow. So. Wow. Yeah, I don't want to hit them. I just want well, to admire them. They're big. <laughs> yeah, what One day I was driving a passenger from the Pearson Airport to a place called Aurora. Yeah. And they got off on the road away from the busy road. Busy road. And I saw a big one with a handler right before me. I, had, I purposely wanted to hit him. I wanted the back leg. And my passenger said, if you had hit him, we'd take the rest of it, you know. He, he was so big and he couldn't move, but when the light got to him, the light went under his, because a big one. Light went under his head and he both dead. <laughs> yes, that's a honey bear, but I wouldn't want to hit him otherwise. And the man says, if I had hit him, you would have taken three quarters of it. I, I never had deer meat. I've had car goats on the way, but never deer meat. But I'm enjoying my life. I thank God for being so good, you know, I fight for my family. And I work really hard, but now I have a chance to see. I even come to pray and say I might see some. Before I, before I started praying, I saw them. <laughs> so, you got answered. Yeah, I got answer. I got answer. And I wanted, I wanted not to come so far because being retired, you don't have money to bag, yeah. So I wanted to go down by the canal on um, um, Highway 20. Yeah. Right, what I meant to know. I really want to see the deer today. So I came all the way down here. I left my wife at Wendy's at um at London's name this side there, American American Hotel. Yeah. And I came all the way here. I'm going down to that private like a quiet tier down here too. <laughs> because I'd like to see vegetation. <laughs> it's wonderful. nice talking with you, so God bless you. A pleasure. Amen.